Shea, for all who don't know. I am a medical assistant um, working in internal medicine. And comment, you know, pause this. Comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. You can see more about, you know, what I do as a medical assistant in internal medicine. But right now, I would like to make a video on, you know, medical assisting, you know, going for your certificate and then going for your associate's degree. Right now, I do have my associate's degree in science and in medical assisting. So, I wanted to compare them for people who don't know or people who was trying to decide on what to do or which one to go for. So, right now, I have my notes. So, you know, got to be ready. But, you know, okay. So, starting with number one, um, how long does it take, you know, to obtain this degree or this certificate? For, you know, for the um, degree, the associate's degree, you know, it takes between one to two years to get it. So, with, with the full, going full-time is one to two years. You know, part-time, you might have to add on an additional one to two years you know, to complete the program to become, be get, to get your associate's degree. Um, for students who's getting their certificate, um, it takes, um, I'll say at least one year to complete the program. And then it may add on additional time because you want to do your internship, you know, to get the flow of what you need to do and stuff like that. Um, the classes you need to take for, associate, for me, for associate's degree and a certificate, it depends on which college you go to for me. You know, because I know for a fact you're going to have to take anatomy and physiology, medical terminology, lab, you know, and clinicals and pharmacology and stuff like that. That goes with the, clin with the certificate and the associate's degree. Those are kind of some of the main classes that you will have to take. For certificate and the associate's degree, but for, in my opinion, I think it depends on which which college you go to. Whether it's a community college, a four-year college, it depends on which college you go. You sign up for. Um, and let me see. Um, also, certificate to me is like a diploma. So you really won't be doing a lot. Like the type of jobs that you would be eligible for after you complete the program. So like for for an associate's degree, um, you, can, you can do stuff in specialized fields like podiatry, internal medicine, um, which will give you a higher salary. Now, because you'd be doing more with the associate's degree than the certificate or the diploma. With a certificate and diploma, you know, it depends on how many classes you take for the certificate. So, you know, then the, and then it says the individual may not be necessary as well to work in a specialized, specialist office. So, most likely you probably would like be at the hospital, stuff like that, but you won't be making the same amount as, as a medical assistant that has an associate's degree because this is a degree, it's not a certificate or a diploma, stuff like that. Um, the salary, you know, I can't speak on it because every state is different for every MA position. Like Ohio, um, when I started working in internal medicine, when I started as an MA, I was making $13 and some change. So I have got raises since then but I get raises every year. Um, but it depends on your state. Like I said, you won't be making as much as a medical system with the associate's degree. You will be making less with the certificate and diploma. Um, I think, uh, I think um, being a medical assistant is a good thing to become because I feel like it does it does help you if you want to become a nurse in the future it does help you complete courses like those courses that you take as a, a medical assistant it does transfer over to a nurse so you won't have to take so many classes but right now I want to do something different I want to I do want to complete my bachelor's degree 
to in healthcare administration because with that, a lot of my classes transferred with that bachelor's degree at the health administration, it, a lot. So I really didn't have to take a lot, but with me, you know, I ran out of financial aid, so I have to do scholarships and stuff. So I wasn't able to complete my bachelor's, but I'm trying to go back to complete that. Um, but, you know, being a medical assistant, you learn so much stuff. You learn so much stuff. Like, at the point where you're doing what the nurses, what the, well, I can't say registered nurses or any, what, any type of nurses. I can't say that. But LPNs, you can do whatever the LPN is doing. It, it depends on which which office you go to. Like the hospital, I feel like they just give vitals and stuff like that. You know, with a certificate, you just give vitals. You know, you you really don't do a lot of the, you know, lab stuff, drawing blood, urinalysis, stuff like that. But as a medical assistant with the associate's degree, you know, in my office, you know, we did pap, we helped do pap smears, we helped with minor surgeries like cutting off moles. You know, we helped with pregnancy tests. We did urinalysis, ear lavages. You know, um, drew blood, spinning the blood. You know, we we did a lot. So I feel like if you want to take the extra steps and extra classes to be, to get your associate's degree, I feel like go for it. But if you don't have the time and the, and the money to do it. Get your certificate and then go back and, and get your associate's degree. Continue to get your associate's degree. That's why I feel like. But I did go further and got my associate's degree. And, you know, I started off in internal medicine. And hopefully I can venture out and do something different. Maybe become an LPN or an RN or, you know, maybe go back and finish the bachelor's degree or whatever. But those are some of the things I would like to say about um, certificate, diploma versus associate's degree in medical assistant. You guys work hard, stay positive, and keep it going. Pray. Pray every day, even if you're mad, sad, whatever, happy, glad, whatever. <laughs> You guys have a good one. My name is Lachey. Please go subscribe and like and comment on this video. And you guys have a blessed day. Bye.